Efforts are underway to get ready for tomorrow's Art and Bloom Festival in downtown Medford. It's Vogel Plaza and about eight surrounding streets, so as you head downtown you can't miss it. But there's so much to do for everybody. So if you're thinking of bringing your children down, Amy Rose, an event coordinator with Art and Bloom, says do it because there's a lot to keep them busy. We have Hope Ranch. They're bringing a baby animals um, animal tent where they can they can touch and feel some of the animals and experience some of them. Rose says in addition to the petting zoo, they have a world-class BMX freestyle team doing a demonstration. There will also be more than 100 shopping booths in case you still need to get that Mother's Day present. Art and Bloom staff say one of the best parts of the event is what it does for businesses downtown. And we'll always be downtown Medford. Um, Medford merchants have their highest sales of the whole year during Art and Bloom. Robert Gallus has owned a business downtown for 20 years and says the community celebration brings life to a dying area. I like the Art and Bloom. They've taken a lot of stuff away from the main street and put it over to the commons. Art and Bloom, I think, is the last thing. And it brings a lot of people in. Michael Sesnick runs local coffee shop downtown grounds with his sister. He says events like these bring in tons of foot traffic, which is always good for business. I expect there's going to be a line out the door for a good portion of the day. Rose says the event is free, so you can put your money elsewhere. So there is really no cost, Art and Bloom, and save your money for shopping at our artisans and help them come back to Medford every year. Covering your news, Jackie Garrity, News 10.